Okay, this was, uh, or this is, an AS electronics lesson with students who have been doing electronics for about uh, eight weeks now and having been introduced to logic gates in a practical way by working on a, a logic board, we've now moved on to Boolean algebra as a means of uh, mathematically expressing logic problems and today we are having a look at some applications of Boolean algebra in traffic lights, a traffic light setup, and in making a two into one multiplexer. Well, yesterday we had an introduction to Boolean algebra, so we'll uh, start off today by just having a look at uh, how we apply in uh, some situations what we learned about. Uh, Boolean algebra and how it can be used mathematically to deal with uh, logic situations. Right, who's uh, learning to drive? Right, okay, well, who shall we choose? Choose you, Jack. Have you done your theory test yet? Yeah. Oh, well, this should be a, a doddle for you then. What is the, uh, what is the traffic light sequence, starting with the uh, if we say that the red is on, the amber is off, the green is off, what, what's next? Um, red is off, amber is, no, red is on, amber is on, the green is off. Followed by? Red is off, amber is on, and green is off. No. no. <laughs> did you pass? Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> say again? Off. On. Followed by? Off, on, on. Off. off. <laughs> <laughs> Followed by? On, off, off. Okay, in other words, we go back to there, don't we? So if then we um, look at this and think, well, there's only going to be four possible states for our traffic lights, and so we could start off with uh, zero, 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 one, one, zero, one, one. And then if this represents our inputs to a system, then what we've got to devise is a logic system that's going to respond with one, zero, zero for that situation, one, one, zero for that situation, zero, zero, one for that situation, and finally, when we've got one and one, we want zero, one, zero. So, remember what we did yesterday. When we're using Boolean notation, what we have to do is to write the appropriate logic for, well, red is one when. So, how will we describe the situation? Firstly, red is one when what are we going to say in Boolean? What would we write in Boolean? When would it be A plus B equals zero? It isn't A plus B, though. It's A, a or B. B. A, and a and B, then. Well, is it? 